force will be with you always. One of the most exciting aspects of the Ahsoka live action show coming in August has been that it's going to be Grand Admiral Thrawn's debut of live action. He was mentioned in Mandalorian seasons two and three. The name is out there. We know it's coming and it's something that has gotten everyone, myself included, excited about this show. I can't wait. Even Dave Filoni has said that Thrawn is going to be the big bad through this series of Star Wars. So it makes sense that fans would be upset and even worried at some of the surprising comments that Lars Mikkelsen has made regarding the character of Thrawn. If you don't know who Lars Mikkelsen is, he's the voice actor who was Thrawn's voice throughout all of the animated shows that Thrawn was on. He voice acted Thrawn for six years. There's no one better cast for this role. And when he was chosen for the role, fans were excited because they knew the continuity that it would bring. He knows the character inside and out. He's embodied Thrawn himself. He's even acted things out, I'm sure, as he's voice acted. He's put on that persona. There's no one better than Lars Mikkelsen to play this role. So why the comments to On Demand Entertainment about there being a detaching and something new of this character? That's what has fans worried. 2017 is the last time that Mickelson has spent time being Grand Admiral Thrawn. And so over those six years, a lot of things have happened. And so it wasn't a surprise when he was asked the question, have you gone back and watched or rewatched any of Star Wars Rebels in preparation for this role? Even if he said no, that might not necessarily be a bad thing. Why? Because He's done it. It's not like he's stepping into a new character. He lived it. He knows Thrawn. But instead of saying no, he said this. No, I didn't really. We needed to do something else. So I wanted to detach myself from that to create something new. Now he'll go on to talk about how well he knows the character and how he's done all of these things and he didn't feel he needed to, but it's really that idea of detaching himself from that to create something new that has fans worried. And I wouldn't be lying if I didn't say myself, it has me a little bit concerned, but I don't think this calls for outrage or panic as the show approaches. Instead, let's take it from the perspective of someone who's going to go from voice acting to now live action. It's very different to put on the makeup, step out onto the set and actually act alongside others. There's a different mentality there. So if we're taking this at its best case scenario, what he's saying is this something new, this something fresh needs to be a little bit different because of the way that live action is different than animation. And, and even how you approach that in the mental aspect of acting, I'm sure is quite different. So if that's the positive, what could be the negative. Well, the negative is that there's going to be something different about Thrawn than what we've seen in Rebels or even maybe in the, the novels by Timothy Zahn. And those have been fantastic. I've even been re-listening back to some of those. I shared that in a previous video, but I really enjoyed those novels, particularly the ways that you see Thrawn build up these strategies and these battles to all be the way he wants them to be, to move things around, to predict the enemy's moves perfectly. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, I don't really want to give away any spoilers if you are going to go read those books. But ultimately, even if this something new is a departure, I really don't think that's going to be the case. I really don't think Dave Filoni is going to change from what has been, and he's really going to respect the character as it's been created and written. And so maybe I'm putting too much trust in Dave Filoni, but until I've seen otherwise, that's what I'm going to do. So don't be upset. 
don't be afraid. I don't think this is a bad thing. I think this is just people taking these words a little bit too out of context and kind of just hyper focusing on that word detach and something new. And I don't think that means that we're going to get a Thrawn that we don't recognize. Instead, it means for the actor himself, he has to approach it differently. And going back and rewatching Rebels wasn't going to help him. I don't know. That's my perspective. As always, let me know what you think down in the comments below. Would love to hear, am I wrong? Am I right? What is your perspective? Were you worried when you saw this news? Also, if you haven't hit that like button, really appreciate it. it helps get this out to others, especially those who might be a little nervous at some of this news. And remember, the force will be with you always.